Hi everyone and welcome back for a new video on BurmeseLesson.com. Are you interested to learn some new vocabulary in Burmese? Well, this lesson is for you. We will teach you some of the most common animals like dog, cat or bird. So, let's not wait any further. First, let's check how to say dog. Listen carefully. Kui. Kui. Now you turn to speak it out. Try to repeat. Kui. So, what about an example sentence? Did you hear the word kui in the sentence? Let's hear it one more time. Next one now. Zhao. Zhao. Did you get it? So, let's repeat it. Zhao. Zhao nui ga so tani. Then, any idea how to say bird in Burmese? It's a very short word, but it might be difficult for you to pronounce it. Listen. Nga. Nga. Ever heard any words like this? It has an aspirated nasal sound at the beginning. Try to repeat it now. Nga. Let's see what Zhao has to say about birds then. The next one is similar in pronunciation. Nga. Any idea what it could be? Right, a fish. Let's listen again. Nga. Repeat it after Zhao. Nga. All right, now one sentence as well. Next. Sing. Elephants are one of the animals that are endemic to Myanmar, and having a white elephant is symbol of success. And white elephants were considered royal animals some time ago. So it will be a big event if you ever hear a sentence like this one. Pew is the white color in Burmese. So when you hear Simpu, it means white elephant. Next one is bees. Bia. Bia. Okay, try to repeat it now. Bia. Wow, hope you're not allergic to bees. Let's listen again. Two more to go now. Not the most likable of all animals, but let's see how to say snake. Mui. Mui. Can you pronounce it the same way as Zaw? Not easy, right? Listen carefully and try to repeat. Mui. Nga mi ga mui chao de. One more time. Nga mi ga mui chao de. And the last one is rat. It is. Jue. Jue. You have quite a lot of them in many big cities. Yangon is no exception. So let's listen what Zo has to say about them. Alright, now let's listen again. I bet a few people like them, but it can also be a very nice pet. It is not uncommon for someone to have a rat as a pet, and they are very intelligent. Alright, Let's review the lesson and listen to each animal's name one after the other. Kui. Zhao. Nghe. Nga. Sin. Bia. Mui. Zhe. That's all for this lesson. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you want to learn more vocabulary and sentences, just go to BurmeseLesson.com and follow our audio and video course. Till next time, bye-bye. Ta-da! Namatwe meno!